It basically just said, your skin's shit, it's the driest skin I've ever seen, you've got wrinkles, this is really deep. Selamat Datang Divideo Gazrite Laliana, Betri by Kapatag, Legiano, Mutila by Crab, Ditempat, Karajaj. That is literally my attempt saying welcome to another Gaz Right video. Shout out to the crab legend of the scene and my attempt a little bit of the old Indonesian. As you can see, language is not my strong suit. We've got a little travel day today. We're moving for this insane little pad. Check the pool light behind me. Silly, silly setup. £13 a night just shows you how unreal the uh, places you can get in Bali, how cheap you can get them and for such good quality as well. Shared pool, but cannot complain at that. Moving over to Lombok today. So hopefully a little bit more relaxed life, a little bit more beach action. Um, hopefully a couple of bits of hiking, a bit of fitness. There's all sorts over the next seven days. Going to be doing another apartment tour there because yeah, silly, silly setup, silly, silly value. Um, and yeah, I think we've got like a mezzanine room where we've got like a double bed in one part and then upstairs for the for the single beds as well. So yeah, anyone needs a spare room in, uh, in Lombok over the next week, me and the king can sort you out. We've got a little creator club call and the quote of the day is consistency builds success over the next month it is the month of the rig so we're going to be doing a little bit of fitness every day so hopefully going to be signing up to the gym a little bit later or getting a little run in the bones as always whatever the top comment is down below we'll be doing the following video so if you have any ideas anything you want to see me do bang it down there while you're down there hit that subscribe button still en route to the massive 2k subs appreciate you all let's get cooking baby at the airport in Bali, I've just been absolutely done over in the skincare shop. And it's like, oh, let's go over, let's go and have a look, see what's going on. And they're like, oh, we're offering free, like, skin consultations. You put your head in this little thing, give you some readings. Emma's gone in, it's gone beautiful skin, gorgeous. She's got all the perfect levels and everything. Just shows you if you do your skincare routine, it looks good. I've been forced in, peer pressured. Now I'm joking, I was like, let's get it done. The woman's gone. You've got the, it basically just said, your skin shit is the driest skin I've ever seen. You've got wrinkles, this is really deep. You need to use this, this, to be fair, it's even worse because normally I think, oh, they tell you it's really bad and then try and sell you something. The woman's like, I would just advise these things, didn't even try and sell me anything. So yeah, maybe I do need a little bit of a, the old skincare to get up to the king's levels. However, um, check the trainers out. This is how hard it is for me to get trainers in, well, all of Asia. I had to get my mum and dad to bring these out because I'm absolutely sized boats, but they are an absolute naughty bit of kit. So comfort the calves as being massaged every single step of the way. And another huge positive, when you're in the UK, you go to the airport, meals are ridiculously priced and drink, say if it's like a pound for a drink or two pound for a drink, and the shop, you go to WH Smith and it's about 15 pounds. You have to literally liquidate a lung for a Burger King and a drink. Me and Em, nice little bit of lunch. Em's was two pound, mine's was about six pound. And the drinks in there, bottle of water, bottle of orange juice, still 50p. The same as outside, same in the airport. Indonesian people on another level, another minus point for the UK. We'll see you for a room tour in Lombok very, very shortly. Lombok Villa Tour. We're not in the luxury, we need these shady private pools, private villas anymore, but there's still a decent bit of kit. Nice little shared pool, I'm sure we'll be in there at some point. And then yeah, the maddest entrance because that's the door to our gaff. We'll just come this way and just absolutely skip straight through it. A few little chair worries. Oh, shout out the boy. Um, but yeah, we celebrate the wins, we celebrate the losses. Maddest gaff we've ever stayed in, like check out this. My granny would be absolutely loving this. Little sofa bed, not sure we're gonna be needing that. It's absolutely ice cold in here, so if there's one positive to take, it is the aircon is absolutely sensational. We're gonna be showering <laughs> pretty much outside, but yeah, still plays ball, and obviously it's just me and Em, but if you did have a few friends, or if you're stuck in Lombok, the team can sort you out because We've got a little mezzanine gaff, uh, so this will not be getting any action unless the king's snoring and she will be relegated to the upper echelons. But yeah, pretty big space, so yeah, get a little bit of work done. A little desk wouldn't go amiss. Um, and then yeah, you've just got a little outside gaff here. Not really sure what we'll get up to out here. Bit of morning yoga, Pilates, absolutely not. And then yeah, back to the pool. So we celebrate the wins, we celebrate the losses. Um, and yeah, we'll not be writing home on this one, but plays a little bit of ball, we'll get the job done. And yeah, we're gonna be lifting some weights around and getting involved with the Creator Club right about now, baby. Yeah, I gotta keep dreaming, gonna keep going, yeah, I gotta keep
pushing, gotta keep breathing. Yeah, I gotta keep working. Yeah, this for the moment. Start with a million. And I want my mansion. So my family knows that. We are set for life. Yeah, ain't nothing that's gonna take over. She know what they're gonna take it, but I grab it. I'm a habit. I've been cutting my habits. So I gotta do it, man. I thought I'm the madness. Cause I've been really better, man. I want my status. Damn, they gonna see that I do this. They gonna see that I did this though. Now they say, oh shit, I can't do the same. with you kidding, bro? Cause I spend my time just working. But I spend my time just grinding. But I spend my time in the studio with these lyrics. Just combining. Just fortune all these diamonds. Cause I made it from far. And nobody believed it. But I showed them what I was. It's sure. Make you more believe Told me I was a kid And never will complete it Never do just all these things But they don't even know me They don't know what I can bring It's thunder out the sky I'm electric with these things Like I'm so electric I'm about to do it I put in the work And I sold on my gas This time on my ship And I'm sailing the west Ay, Homie, I just be the captain I'm so my brothers and people The way that we move Like we about to get this Homie, we working so hard Like all of our time We've been investing Investing in the work Investing in my time Investing in Another gym session in the bones, new gym in Lombok. It looks like an absolute banger. We'll be getting involved a little bit more in the daytime, so hopefully it's a little bit more active. Went through a little push session with M, push full body, and I tell you what, those body weight skull crushers, they're a humbler. Like, literally, I think I did like two or three, and you had to go back to the uh, the normal ones. But before that, had a creator club call. So we've been doing this for a month with Louis Armstrong, and we had guest speakers of Joe and Kev today, both sharing their stories of like how they I mean, quit their nine to five. One's traveling the world, one is also traveling the world slash doing some fitness stuff. And I think the key takeaway from that was post about what you're passionate about. You don't need to be an expert in it. Um, and I think that's what I'm gonna try to do more and more of in these uh, in these videos. The music's building up behind me, hopefully building a bit of expense, but uh, expense or, or suspense. Um, but yeah, I think that's it. I wanna post more gym content. I'm not unbelievable in the gym. I'm not anywhere near good. Obviously got humbling off Sam yesterday, but there's gonna be more gym content coming. And I think while we're in Bali as well, I'm gonna work out without my top on, because I think it's an added motivator to get the rig in shape, lose a couple pounds of the old body fat and put a bit of size on. So yeah, that's the goal for the next month. If you're enjoying the day vlogs, if you have any questions, any comments, what should we do for the rest of the week? Bang it in the comments down below. I'll see you in the next one. Still en route to 2K subs. See you then, baby.